You know what else I wanted to mention, Lorraine? That you had this brilliant idea, which no one took us up on, okay? And it was about stop and frisk. Because the, the stop and frisk trial is coming to come to a, a head in a couple weeks, actually. There's all been so, so, all sorts of maneuvering about it. But you made a suggestion last summer uh, after we interviewed Romarley Graham's mom. You remember Romarley Graham was the teenager who was shot by the policeman uh, in front of his grandmother in the bathtub for a small bag of weed, which was empty. And he was killed. Um, you said that they wouldn't have had to do that if they had a drug or gun sniffing dog. And, you know, that's one way to, if stop and frisk is only catching 4% of the people with drugs or guns, if we got rid of stop and frisk and we just had all these dogs doing the sniffing, A, you'd reduce the color barrier because you'd stop as many white people as you do black people because as many white people carry guns as do carry marijuana. It's shown, that is shown. Um, and you'd have much higher return on investment and much higher success rate. And you'd have to use fewer policemen and fewer people would be put in danger because the dogs would know who to go after and who not to go after. That was your idea, Lorraine, and I don't know why, out of all this melee of political confusion... Why well, do? Huh? I know why it wasn't popular, because a canine dog doesn't get a salary. Know what I mean? I suppose so. But, I mean, it doesn't really mean you would have to... to um, cut, lay off people from the police force. It just means that those people on the police force that are doing the search and seizure wouldn't have to work as hard because the dog would actually do all the work and they wouldn't have to, you know, pat people down and get into risky confrontations okay. with angry people. Hello, you're on the air. Hi, this is Julia. Um, I think with the stop and frisk, damn if you don't, damn if you do do with the stop and frisk, you know, because they stop blacks and Puerto Ricans. You understand? It's good in one way, it's bad in another. So I don't know if they stop that. I don't know what would happen to the world. Yeah, but how about we use dogs to, to figure out who to stop? Because the dogs can smell the guns and the marijuana. You understand? But you but you don't want dogs sniffing and smelling, dogs coming up on you sniffing and smelling you, Yeah, right? but would you rather have a dog coming and sniffing you, or you want a police to throw you up against the wall? I'd rather have a dog, though, but, uh, but a dog, like, I don't know. Uh, like a dog in the airport, those dog, those bombs, drug-sniffing dogs, they just sniff. When they get a whiff, they start barking. They don't come at you, they just make a lot of noise, and they point their face at the bad guy. It's much better than well, getting thrown up against the wall, man, by a bunch of policemen. You're right about that, about with the police. You know, innocent people get thrown up against the wall and don't have anything on them when they, when they frisk them. Yeah, that's what they do in 96% of the case. That's why Lorraine suggested that they use dogs, because the dogs will be 96% of the time correct. The issue is why they don't do that, ma'am, is I think they'll stop as many white people as they do black people and they, Hispanic people. Are they thinking about doing that? Well, it's just up in the air now. We just no, we, we keep, Lorraine keeps suggesting it on the show, and the mayor's office has not responded to our request that they pay oh, attention know, to it. Boomer, he's an asshole. Well, you said it, ma'am. I didn't say it, you know. I'm saying it. Well, you're allowed to say it, you know. You can say anything yeah, here. Yeah, I can say it. It's only one thing yeah, you can't you know do on this asshole. show. Everybody know he is, huh? Huh? What'd you say? No, you... you <laughs> I was going to say, it's only one thing you can't do on this show, but I'm not going to say what it is, all right? But I know that one thing you can't do, but I can do, but you can't. Okay, and love. And that man's an asshole, and everybody know it. Okay, man. Thank you so much for your call, all right? We got another caller here we're going to take. Okay, bye. Bye.